welcome back to another video. My name is Matthew and welcome to day 22 of the Godzilla Advent Calendar for 2021. And today's is a very special one because we got something that all the way from the 90s is probably older than half of the people watching this. The 1998 Godzilla Trendmasters uh, Fangbite Godzilla, which I know it's Fangbite because it bites, but we'll, we'll get to that in a minute. Um, so what's, uh, what's some things I like, what things I don't like? Some things that I like are definitely its mold. I love the sculpt, the details. I love its glossy to matte kind of transitions throughout the body because you have some parts of the figure that are matte, like the shoulders, but some parts that are glossy, like the neck, more towards up here. And then like, it's just so cool. Especially like the rubbery fins, which these are really rubbery by the way. It's just so cool seeing this. Uh, the pink gums are pretty good as well, although they kind of look a little whitish. Um, the white teeth uh, look pretty good too. Um, the nails are really well done with some nice uh, glossy uh, black paint. Maybe it's nail polish. Although then again, it probably scent like heck. Because I know nail polish scents. Would 20 year old nail polish still have its scent? Maybe. Um, but we have the tail in an interesting pose. It almost looks like an op octopus tentacle. Um, for articulation, there's nothing at the head. Although you do get a bit of up and down movement. But that's more of um, something we'll cover in a minute. Uh, hinge at the jaw, but again, it's more for a gimmick. And, and as you can see, it's spring loaded. Uh, movement up the arm, it allows you to go all the way back here, but if you move the rubbery dorsal fin, you can get some more back all the way down to here. Um, you can go all the way forward down to the knee, or I guess leg. Uh, same thing with this part. Yeah, you can go all the way down. Come on. Uh, this leg, come on, I'll cover this leg. This leg, you go up about that far, backwards about that far, both of them can ratchet at the knee, and both of them can move them at the foot. In a back and forth motion. And this has a rotation all the way here, all the way around like this. So if you want to hit into like cup something, like grab something, maybe it's like one of those cartoon uh, hooks on stage, maybe it like comes onto the stage and then grabs the per person off the stage. If you want to do that, it really could. And uh, I know there's a seam line here, but there's nothing there because it's definitely glued in there. And you might have noticed that I didn't point out this leg. Because this leg is actually for a gimmick. You pull down his, um, this leg and you'll see him starting to like mouth your movement a little bit. Like that's just me doing it. You can do it without me talking. And then you're going to pull that all the way. Yeah, you guys hear that? I'm going to hold it up to the microphone better so you can guys can actually hear that. Mine is very low on battery probably or something's damaged with the speakers. But then again, this thing is again 20 years old. And he also came with like a little display base which is pretty cool. Um, for things I don't like, there's not much I can really say I don't like. It's a fairly simplistic, decently put together action figure. I would complain about the screw holes, but again, um, I already pointed that out in my uh, Giant Kong uh, 2021 Godzilla vs. Kong 11-inch, okay, you can stop roaring, uh, for 2021, which was day one, I believe, and I said that I'm so, so used to screw holes on toys at this point, it doesn't affect me anymore, so. Um, with that being said, uh, do I recommend him? Yes, absolutely. Uh, you, you can probably find him on like eBay. Amazon, anything like that, any like aftermarket prices because, well, I think I got this guy for a decent price, I think. But uh, that being said, uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you can find this guy for a good price, you can. Maybe some, um, what is it? Uh, oh, I forget what it's called. Um, auction stores, that's an option. Um, yeah, uh, there's other sites you can get it from. But uh, that being said, thank you guys for watching. If you did, like and subscribe to the channel so you never miss another Godzilla video when they're uploaded or any type of video that I'm uploading at the time. And I'll see you guys ne next time. Peace out, everyone.